Hi, my name is David Lee. I'm one of the developers uh, on the Microsoft Robotics Studio and today I wanted to show you a little bit about our simulation environment and talk about how that interacts and how it's very similar to the real world environment that we're doing the sumo competition on. Um, and so what I have here is we have a, um, a physics engine that is built by Agia that ships with our product um, and is free, free for uh, users who just want to play around with it. Um, and we uh, simulate many of the robots that we also work with in, in, in real life, including the iRobot. And so uh, in this um, particular example, I've, I've brought up the sumo ring and the iRobot, and I can actually move around in this environment. I, I can zoom in and I can look around at the, at the robot. I can change my view and you can see the, the actual wireframe uh, physics, uh, what the physics sees. Um, and I can also see uh, kind of the rendered version of that. Um, so if I back back up again and I start a the sumo referee, I can pick uh, a couple of different uh, sumo bots uh, that I'd like to try out, and I'll try Sitting Duck and Sumo Son uh, David Lee, and I'm going to go ahead and start those. Now I'll change this back just to the vision view and I'm going to start the match. Now the great thing is that we get the same sensors in the physics environment that we also get in real life. So if you don't have a robot available to you right now, you can get started immediately using the physics environment. And you can see in this particular physics environment that if the robot falls out and tips over, it's not going to be, when the wind's wheels spin, it's not going to be able to go anywhere. Uh, so it works very much like the real life environment. It's, it's great for schools as well um, because if you only have one or two robots and many uh, individuals, they can, uh, they can uh, all work on their own algorithms and then when the physical robot is available, they can try it out there as well. So here these are moving around and uh, and we have a very um, simple algorithm right now that's, that this is running with. Uh, but number one is the one that I wrote. This is my little daughter right here. <laughs> and, uh, and this one wins every time. What do you know? <laughs>